There is a super simple code that I like to use to create two columns of text on a Squarespace website, but there are some key details that can make a big difference in how you use this code and how it works. I'm Becca Harpain from Inside the Square, and in this tutorial, we're going to be customizing Squarespace to create two columns of text. Without further ado, I'll go ahead and share my screen so we can get started. Here we are inside Squarespace, and right here on this page, I have a large paragraph that I want to break out into multiple columns. To do this, we're going to add the custom code that you'll find underneath this video. Now, on the left-hand side of the screen, I need to select Pages, then Website Tools, then Custom CSS. This is where we'll be adding our code. This text right here happens to be a paragraph two text type. So I'm going to add the letter P, then open up a curly bracket and say Columns 2 and instantly my text will separate into two columns of content. Now I think the gap in between these columns is too small. The text is really close together and I don't think there's a clear enough distinction. So I'm gonna add another line of code here that says column gap, how about 50 PX? Now we're getting a separation between these two columns, a gap of 50 pixels in width. You can customize this value to anything you want, maybe 150 pixels is more your style, and you can also adjust the columns. If you don't want to, maybe three is more in line with what you're going for. Both lines of this code are very customizable for whatever suits the style of your own website. But we're not quite done. Before we cover anything else in this tutorial, let's take a look at the mobile version of our website. Two columns on mobile with a big gap in between them looks terrible. We need to make sure that this code only happens on larger screens. To do that, I'm going to add a media query. And again, you'll find this entire code underneath the video. But what I just told the computer browser is that on any screen that is at least 767 pixels wide or larger, that's when we need that paragraph text to take up two columns. So now we'll go back to the desktop view. We'll see the two columns there. But again, on the mobile view, we only have one column that we're working with. Definitely an important distinction to know. And again, this code is underneath the video. Now here inside the desktop version, I'm going to hop into edit mode to show you something that's really important to know if you're going to use this code. Let's say that right here, we actually want to have a space between these paragraphs. We want a full line break. If I hit enter on my keyboard, it makes a hot mess. The top left column and the top right column go together. Then the bottom left column and the bottom right column go together. And that is not how we read columns. So I need to remove the space I just added. And what I'm going to do is press shift and return on my keyboard at the same time to create a soft return. And now you can see that the bottom of the left column takes us to the top of the right column. That is how you can add that space when you're using a column code. Again, I'm pressing shift enter on my keyboard to make that line break without breaking the content. Very important to know. The other thing I wanna mention are the different types of text. Inside Squarespace, paragraph text goes by the letter P, and that's what we worked with in this tutorial. Paragraph one is this particular code, SQSRTE large. Paragraph three is SQSRTE small. Individual headings have their own codes, and if you want to target all of the text in a blog post, you can use the word article. You'll find example codes for all of these underneath the video. But one last thing that I want to show you before we call this a wrap, trust me, the very last thing, is what to do if you only want one piece of paragraph text to get this two-column effect. I've got another set of paragraph text on my site. I don't want this to be changed. I only want this to happen to this block of content right here. To change just one block at a time, we need to target its block ID. I'll select save and exit, and I'll walk you through this process step by super simple step. Scrolling down here, this is the content that we want to have in two columns. This content needs to go back to normal. So what I'm going to do is click on a Chrome extension that I have, a free Chrome extension that you'll find linked below. This Chrome extension displays the block ID for the content here on my website. This is a unique number given just to this piece of content. No other content on my website has this number. So I can click this to copy it. I'll turn off the Chrome extension. And here in front of the letter P in my code, I'm going to paste that unique ID number. Now everything looks the same here on our screen, but if we scroll down, you'll see this has returned to normal. I have told the computer browser that on any screen that is larger than 767 pixels, pixels in width. When you see this block of content, if there's paragraph text inside of it, make sure that text has two columns and the gap between those two columns is 150 pixels in width. And there you have it. We just turned a block of text into two columns of text on our Squarespace website. I'll go ahead and select save and we'll call this tutorial good to go. 
And there you have it, my friend. I've included the code and links to additional resources underneath this video. So if you want to learn more about customizing your Squarespace text, definitely check out those other resources. I'm Becca Harpain from Inside the Square, and I've got a lot more to teach you about all the cool things that Squarespace can do. If you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments. And most importantly, have fun with your Squarespace website. Bye for now. Good news, Squarespacer. We finally have an AI that truly understands Squarespace. Meet Custom Cody. Built specifically for Squarespace users and trained on every nuance of the program, Custom Cody is your AI-powered assistant for effortless expert-level Squarespace customization. Available now at customcody.com.